Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Doing some modern today. Magic. Indeed. So, today we have an interesting matchup. I am playing a food combo deck. Yeah, so my deck is uh, trying to assemble a bunch of foods. There's a combo kill that can win on the spot, and uh, if you don't get that, then you can just beat down with a bunch of early 7-6 Trample Vigilance guys, which is pretty good. And I am playing a uh, Ferris Ma Mardu deck. Yeah. This is the Ferris Rock Rick. Mm -hmm. Very interesting card. So, to decide who goes first, we've got a dice here with a bunch of creatures on it. And I'm thinking most edible. Most edible? Most edible, since it is a, a food day. So I'm going to get a eagle, eagle, I believe that is. I mean, it's, it's sort of edible. Eagle. It's uh, it's illegal. <laughs> it's illegal US. to eat an eagle. Yes. It's also illegal, I think, to eat a horse. But a horse is probably a little more edible than an eagle. Yeah, I think a horse is a little more edible. And, I, and the, I'm pretty sure there are parts of the world where you can eat horse. Yeah. Right? So that'll be you. Going first, and we will see you in game one. All right, game one. Go ahead. We've got... Those. And for me, taking a bit of a risk here, but I think with these, it might be worth it. All right. Let's see what you got. We're gonna go for a bloodstained mire. Cracking that for the trial. Sure. Well, that's decent off the top. Untapped overgrown tomb. Going to eighteen, and here is a gilded goose. 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 Pass the turn. That, of course, gets me a food when it enters. Pick up all the cards. <laughs> On tap. Giraffe return. Uh, we're going to go for a black cleave cliffs. Good timing. Black and white. Tide hollow skull. Mm. That's what we got. Um, what does this guy do? Uh, on landfall, he gets a treasure or a food. Not interesting. The mice call that you find a creature. Yes. Put it in my Feasting hand. king. Can eventually be a cheap 7 6. Yes. Um, I think we hide the other mice call. Sure. Take my demonic tutor, essentially. In this deck? Yes. And it is your go. Untap. Draw. Hmm. All right. Um, many partings. We'll get another treat, and we'll go fetch a forest. Which I will play. Um, sure, why not? I'll do it again. <laughs> For another forest. Another food. And your go. This um, one goes to my hand, of course. Draw for turn. Here we're going to go for... Oh, one. Even saw nothing. No, I actually didn't, so that works. Grab the shred and pack. And, uh... Here's Ferris Bueller. Ah! Is this his day off, too? Back for two. Sixteen. Yes, no multicolored, so it is, in fact, his day off. <laughs> Yes, it's your go. All right. 
It's not the worst. Um, okay. Sack of food. Tap that for a white. Here's a tireless provisioner. And then I will play a windswept heath. So landfall yeah. trigger. I will get a... I actually want a treasure with this, so I'll use this gold. And let's see here. Crack going to 15. I'm actually going to go to 13, which facing down a bunch of 4 fours, maybe not the best plan, but get a temple garden with that. And that will get me a gold or a food. I think I want a gold treasure. And to you, untap. Raf returns. Actually, can I have this tapped? I actually don't need the mana. Yeah. I'll just backtrack a little bit, go to 15. I think it's actually worth it for the two life. And... A red and a white. Yep. Manamorphos. Ooh, that's a 4-4. Four four. Four red and a white. And our 4 4 token is uh, Thank You. <laughs> it's not the red and white gold, but you know, feel close good. enough. Draw a card for that. So we have a red and a white. Yes. I think we go a Staple Foundry Untapped, going 15. Ooh. And. Here is a Nahiri. So that's when you cast a multicolored spell, correct? Yes. <sighs> you know, I should have done this earlier, but that's okay. Dispatch with Metalcraft. Oh, uh, yeah. Yes, yes, you should have done that before. I was going to point it at this, but that's going to get out of hand, so <laughs> I should probably deal with that now. So we still do get the one for the Nahiri you do. cast. Which may cost me this game. Who knows? Yeah, that's why I didn't need the garden. Because I still have three. Even yeah. Second. So here you will go up to six. Discarding a bloodstained mine. To draw a card. Sure. And, uh... Well, the four fours are made this time. Trading a 2 2 for your 3 2 that you desperately want. This is not the play. So it's your go. <laughs> Untap. Draw a card. Mm. 15. Not fantastic. But I do have this. Here's a Verdant Catacombs, which will give me a gold. And I will crack that, going to 14, grabbing a basic swamp, which will get me a food. Nah, gold. And then four... And two of these, six total. Feasting Troll King, cast from my hand. So I get three foods. Five, and now you have a seven, six. And here's also a Sarah Seer, sacking my last gold. Two. Untap. Draw 
Roth return. Um, no. This time we're going to go for a Colligan's Command. Hmm. Returning General Ferris Rockrick. Sure. I'm giving two damage to that. I will. So you still got both, right? Yes. Yeah. I'll sack that in response to Scry 1. Sack it to itself. Hmm. Yes. Top. And... Here we'll go to 8. Sure. To discard an Angrath's Rampage, which is uh, not very helpful for killing a 7 6. No. <laughs> and, uh. Well, attacking with the 4 is still in his worth. So it's your go. Untap. Draw. Here's a forest. Getting gold. Technihiri. Go to one. Here's another Troll King. Cast. Jesus. <laughs> Giving me eight foods total. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Yeah, I'm so happy these have Vigilance because it gets around the uh, minus two on Yuhiri. Very nice. Yeah. Well, you have no no cards in hand, so no. we'll go plus to discard this Tide Hollow. Yeah, I guess that's not very useful. No, not anymore. Um, and Mesa. And here is General Ferris Rockrix. Yes. We'll pack this from 14. I suppose the planes. Lightning Helix Atom. Dead. 17. And a 4 4. Yes. The most annoying part. And uh, it is your go. And it. Draw. It's not terrible. Hmm. Smash face for 14. Smash face for 14. We will block one of them with two. I mean, I guess we may as well just sure. <laughs> three in front of that one. Okay, so essentially kill one of these. Yeah. And you take seven? I take seven going to ten. And then sack three foods, bring him back. And here is the Underworld Cookbook. What does that do? Discard a card to create a food. And pay four in a second to get a creature back. Q. Any creature that will work bring you back? You might actually. Untap. Draw for turn. Uh, it's like a oh, oh, it's a tapped, tapped artifact. artifact. Yeah. 
Yeah. I thought it was just tapped creature. Well, you do have the mana to use it anyway. Hmm. Yeah, I probably would have just used it in response. <laughs> Go to five. Discard the Sacred Foundry. Yush. Hmm. Four mana. Mm-hmm. Going to hear you the harbinger. Ah, <laughs> okay. That makes a four four. Yep. Go to six. Discard a Ragavan, who is definitely not going to connect with two seven sixes running the bow. Mm. Draw a card. Hmm. Ah. Four four. <laughs> Oh man, it's getting out of hand. And it is your go. And a turn. Create a food. Yep. Eat a food. <laughs> Gaining three. Going to 17. Untap. Draw. Hmm. Bash face for 14. Um, well, you can return. Well, no, you can return both. Well, we'll double block each of them. Sure. So, trade for two of them. Mm. And then, oh, yeah. I don't really want to lose this cookbook, so I'm going to do this the not as fun way, I guess. Make a food. Sack my foods. <laughs> yeah. Get back my trolls. Here is a cauldron familiar, which I was going to tap the cookbook to yeah. do shenanigans and do it that way, but that way you could easily exile the cookbook, and I don't think I want that. So no, not, worth, not as worth Go to 18 from that. To you. Untap. Draw for turn. Uh, we are going to exile the golden goose. Sure. Uh, one food source. And... Yes, we have that as an option, don't we? It is your go. All right. Untap. Draw. Hmm. Bash face. Fourteen. Um. Level up figure in destiny. Sure. Put six in front of. All right. No, I guess I should. Uh, So white and the red. Yep. Lightning helix one of them. Sure. One of twelve. And then we block this one and this one. And we did get another one for the lightning helix, yeah. The lightning helix. Okay. Trade with all of that, I assume? Yeah. Yes. So one gets through there, three gets through there, I go to eight. That was my troll kings. Less sad. Um, let's see. It's kind of unfortunate, but... Giant opportunity making two foods. Two foods. Not getting the cool version of it where I get a 7-7 seven, seven for sacking foods. 
Oh, three foods. Sorry. You sack two to get a seven seven, or it makes three. Ah, uh, okay. That's the option. And so that means that they still have Pro. seven six round. Q. Untap. Some hungry trolls. Draw for turn. Gonna go to six. Discard a black blue cliffs. I'm gonna play an air of Mesa. Crap, I go on seven. And. Mountain untapped. Mm hmm. I don't know what actually useful it though. <laughs> Oh, there should be other things in there. Oh, but there's one. Blood crypt tapped. Ah. Yeah, it is your go. Woo! Alright. Draw. Hmm. Bash for seven. Face. Yeah. Yeah. And then the seven, so yeah. that's nice. <laughs> uh we're gonna just eat four of it. Okay. Take three. Go to four. Here we have a gingerbread cabin, which I have three or more other forests, so I get a food out of that. And pass the turn. Untap. Rough turn. Um, here he's going to go to eight. We'll discard a sacred foundry. Yep. Draw a card. And. <sighs> yes. That's the thing. Did your go? Ooh. I'm really surprised you haven't cast another thing. <laughs> End of turn, I'm gonna crack the cookbook, grabbing back the Troll King. Yeah. Untap. Draw. A Troll King. <laughs> mm -hmm. Plus three foods, so that's four. Tacky for seven. Mm. Red, white, black. Ooh. Okay. Oh, no, wait, sorry. Uh, in response to casting that, I have to do this. Never mind, because it's sacrifice a creature with the greatest power among the controls. So I had to do that oh, okay. in response. Sure. So that, and I lose two? Six Yes. Yeah, and then, and then he goes okay. back, and he, gets, he makes food, and he immediately... And then I'll eat them. three of those foods to bring him right back. <laughs> do you... Untap. Draw for turn. And go out. Mm -hmm. Just go to Blightney. Mm -hmm. All right, I just got a four or four. Yes, and yes, you did. I didn't get to attack with anything, so it's not like you didn't use it. Sacrifice a creature. Familiar. Sacrifice a creature. <laughs> Troll king. And it is your go. In the turn, sec. The food to get back familiar during you for one. Go to 17. Go to 3. Untap. Draw. Hmm. to do here. Let's 
17. Probably not just dead to anything. Attack you for 7. Lago with 2, 4 for us. Yep, trade with 1. Um, do this. Lemboss. So, this is a food. When Anna's Battlefield is scry 1, draw. Hmm. Nah. I have to do better than that, I think. Well, I don't know if that's better, but it's something. Here's a Gilded Goose. Getting me a treat. Hmm. Still one off from getting back a troll this turn, unfortunately. Pass the turn. On tap. Draw for turn. Can go up to 12 on here into this kind of blood crypt. Um, sacrifice a creature. Cauldron familiar. Four four. Attack you for eight. Sack of food. Get that cauldron familiar. Drain for one. Eighteen. Two. Block right. one of them. Take four. Fourteen. Mm -hmm. He dies. <laughs> sacrifice Lembass. Get that cauldron familiar. Yeah, you know one. 15. Yeah. Into turn, besage you, destroy tight hollow, tight hollow scholar. Get back my call. Do you have a basic you can fetch, or do you have... Uh, oh, you do have one still, I believe, right? Unless you discarded it. No, I think it's still in there. But I didn't end up taking it. Hmm. No. But I think uh, you know what kills me, so... Yeah. <laughs> uh, are you good then? Yeah. Do you have anything else? Untap. Draw. Oh man, I even get to use it. Uh, attack you for one. <laughs> Eat it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you're at one. I'm at one. I kind of just want to play cards, so I'm going to play cards. Eldonry's call? Yep. And we'll fetch a kitten, which I will cast. And that kills <laughs> All right. So, pretty long game. That was very long. That game. was game one, and we will see you in game two. Have you ever wanted 800% of your entire food pyramid in one meal? Then you should try a big scoop of chubby nubs. Part of a hyperbalanced breakfast, they'll have you saying, please, no more. It comes in bathtub, hot tub, and dump truck sizes. Side effects may include heartburn, cankles, smelling like cheese, inability to see anything from the waist down, inability to see, man schmeebs, having to wear a quilt for a shirt, death, diarrhea, and super death. Don't take chubby numbs if you are indoors unless you have means of being airlifted out of the building. Chubby numbs! They're death in a box. Chubby! All right, game two. Go ahead. We've got... Those. For myself. Those cards. All right. The Sacred Randry Impact. And here's Ragabond. Hmm. Monkey. Monkey. Good. It is your go. Draw. Um. Hmm. I guess you're gonna get a hit off with this monkey, probably. Forest, Gilded Goose, getting a treat to you. 
undead. Giraffe attack. Attack for two. Take it. 18. Can you get a forest if you want it? Um, does the forest help me? I mean, I also get a treasure. Yes. You know what? I'm going to take it. <laughs> you take my forest. Sweet. And, uh, sack this treasure. Uh-huh. Three mana. <laughs> okay. Choose a Ah! Okay. That's, and this is your go. That's early and annoying. <laughs> Draw a card. Oh, man. For real? Um. Shoot. I'm going to go for a many partings, fetching a swamp, swamp. getting food. I'll play that as my land for the turn. And here's a Viscera Seer, too. Untap. Giraffe attack. Mm. Yeah, you need to. Is it gonna hurt? Probably. Um, we're first gonna attack you for two. Can we trade? No. Sixteen. So can get a token. Do you want my verdant catacombs? Well, I played my Aaron Mesa for the turn. Ah, you did. So that is just gone. Um, Aaron Mesa crack rank on the 17th. Flip crit. Okay. And tap to go on the 15th. Four mana. I'm guessing this is a Nahiri, but it could be anything else. Could be a couple things. Even. And we're going to go for green and a red. Yep. Manamorphos, turning it into mm. red and white. Yep. Yeah. And four four. Oh, uh, that's busted. <laughs> and the red, a white, and a black. Blade, maybe? Uh, forest and Feasting Troll King. Yeah, so you do have a Troll King or a cat. And I go to 13. You have to wait till after attacks, thinking you'd have a cat. Mm. And uh, yeah, it's another 4 4. Sure is. And it is your go. Untap. Draw a card. Oh, come on. <laughs> really? Oh, boy. Um, what sort of turn are we looking at here? Here's a windswept heath. Make a food. Eat all three of the foods with Troll King. Mm -hmm. To you. Untap. Draw for turn. Mm. Here's me, sir. Crack that now. Shoot. To get a mountain. Uh. 
I'm going to go to combat. Yep. Swing for 10. Is the monkey worth it? Block one of those. Takes six. Takes six. Going to seven. And you get Samwise Ganji. Mm. If you want it. That's really worth it. So. You could technically cast it. <laughs> Good. Yes, I do have that green there. Yeah. Uh, so we get another treasure, but I'm going to sack one treasure and pay four. Sure. To deal four damage to that mm. cascade. All right. Well, cascade happens first. So we get a four four. Yes. I guess that technically even happens first first. And then... Into lightning helix. Well, that's... That's annoying. Let's get kill, that too. kill a bird too, huh? Another. Well, I'm gonna actually sack the bird to the seer so you don't gain life. Ah, oh, yes, that is, Scry is a thing you can do. Bottom that. And since he's gonna die anyway, I'll sack him also and yeah. scry one. Bottom. Yeah. And uh, there you go. Frack, windswept heath, and the turn. Come to six. Getting a tap temple garden. Unfortunately, <laughs> um, no food and just a Viscera Seer left after all of that. Yes. So no, I'm not, not in a great position. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to rebuild. You also have four 4-4s, four, four, so yes. I have to like win this turn or make enough blockers this turn to... Maybe have another. So let's see. Let's see what we get. Well, a little late for you, but it's funny, so why not? Here's a Gris the Hunger Tide. Yeah. And he will go down to one, sacking my Viserys here to kill that, because it's annoying. <laughs> no general face. And here's a forest to you. Untap. Yeah, I was just dead on board, even Dropping. if I made an insect. So I think that was the right call. Yeah. I mean, the, yeah. The amount of 4 4 there ain't really uh, changing. No. Well, <laughs> let's see what the rest of your hand looks like. Or lightning. Woof. Woof. <laughs> I, I drew that the last turn. That's what that's why I was like, oh, yeah. that's annoying. Because I had this, so I could have actually went and fetched this with the troll. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but... Uh, if you're curious, yes, Crater Hook Behemoth is in here, so you can Eldritch Evolution away a Troll King to get the Crater Hook Behemoth, and then uh, in response to this trigger, you can even get your Troll King back to add an extra creature trigger to it, if you have food. But, uh, yep. Yeah. That's that. That puts you to three, so... Uh, yep. Uh, yeah. Dead. Dead. Uh, just so we can see what you would have got with Monkey, Tireless Prisoner. Probably not worth it. Alright, you got me. That was game two, and we will see you in game three. All right, game three. Show my hand. Oink. And we've got... Those... Whoop. Okie doke. I'm going to lead off with an overgrown tomb untapped. Going to 18. And many partings. Searching for a forest. And you can go. Drop for turn. Black Cleave Cliffs untapped. And, uh, I happen to control no other lands. Hmm. He's a Ragaba. Monkey again. <laughs> Another monkey. Oh man. Is good when you, you know, you're not on the play. Hmm. We're going to find out. <laughs> well, this deck doesn't do a lot of blocking, except for, I guess, with Kitty. So, he might be okay. Uh, hmm.
which I'm actually going to do this turn. <laughs> Kitty. 19. Mm-hmm. And a tapped overgrown tune. Q. Untap. Rough return. Is, is that a thing we do? It doesn't even... No, it's not, because you have a food. So, here's a plains. And here is a Tidehunter Skull deck. Mmm. I'm thinking we're taking that Eldamari's call again. Sure. And it is your go. Do you want to send Monkey into Kitty? No, because you have a food. <laughs> it's, uh, kind of defeats the purpose. <laughs> kind of just a freebie. Um, is that okay? I guess that's okay. Here's a forest. Three mana for a tireless provisioner to you. Untap. Draw for turn. Uh, uh, Manamorphose for a black and a red. Okay. Ooh. Looking for a land? We are looking uh, for a land. And the amount of hat. First 18. Sure. Mm. So whenever I cast a non-creature non spell, I lose two, and you gain two. All right. And uh, yeah, decking tight hollow into a three-two is uh, not the plan. <laughs> kind of want to keep that card then. But... So it's your go. Untap. Draw a card. Okay. So this turn. What do I do? Here's a untapped temple garden going to 17. Tireless provisioner will get a treasure. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Samwise Ganji. Mm hmm. Sack this. To Eldritch the Cauldron Familiar. Yeah. So that goes to the graveyard, and I'll search for something with up to three. And uh, this counts because it's up to three. And then I will. Uh, yeah, and you have a food on there. And then I will sack this food to get back the Cauldron Familiar, draining you for one. Yep. And uh, him entering gets me a food with Samwise Ganji, and then I will sack him to the Viserys Seer, <laughs> and then I'll eat that food, clay him, get another food, rinse yeah. and repeat. And, uh, yeah, that'll do it. That's, I mean, <laughs> if I was adding the call, yeah. Eldritch is also doing it. <laughs> awesome. I actually wasn't sure if I'd be able to do that there, but this was pretty clutch draw off the top, that was, actually. It was, yeah. Because I needed the mana. Because I was going to blight me next turn, even oh, though you had the yeah. Troll King, but that would have uh, mm -hmm. cut out your Eldritch. And I was a ways away from Troll King and Kinging anyway. Yeah. I would, like, once I see him, you didn't really have food. Mm -hmm. Food generators. I was like, well, <laughs> I think we got to... We can go Conval, then Lightning. But, yeah. Uh, yeah. Tyler, this version is just enough. I think... Um, so, I think it may have been better to take the Eldritch Evolution, because that's one I could maybe cast. I actually needed a White Source, which I did oh, have okay. one on top, luckily. That was the only reason that worked. Got pretty didn't lucky even, there. Didn't even but... think to look at your uh, mana sources. Yeah. I what to take. But I, I think it was more or less interchangeable, because even yeah. if you would have taken the Eldritch, I drew this, so I could have just yeah, done, done anyway, it this way. So, uh... Yeah. All right. So, I did it. This is the you first, I, I think this is the first game I've won since we did our little comeback. So, I'm pretty, pretty stoked about that. <laughs> I mean, that first game was pretty entertaining. It was. <laughs> the sheer amount of 7-6s yeah. coming at me. <laughs>
<laughs> Send a 7-6. Block with two 4-4s. Four four. Get it back the 7-6. Next turn. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> All right. So, that was this matchup. Pretty, pretty excited by how that went. I'm happy with it. So, uh, yeah. We will see you next time with some more stuff. Bye!